born to do this. Welcome to the ending finale of Mass Effect 3 Legendary Edition. Here we go. message from Admiral Hackett requesting to come aboard. Permission granted. Aye, Commander. Commander? Admiral? Are you ready to bring the might of the galaxy to bear on the Reapers? Yes, sir. Then let's make sure the fleets are ready. All fleets reporting in, sir. Never before have so many come together from all quarters of the galaxy. But never before have we faced an enemy such as this. The Reapers will show us no mercy. We must give them no quarter. They will terrorize our populations. We must stand fast in the face of that terror. They will advance until our last city falls. But we will not fall. We will prevail. Each of us will be defined by our actions in the coming battle. Stand fast. Stand strong. Stand together. Hack it out. Shepard, the sword fleets are ready to strike at the Reapers surrounding Earth. While they keep the enemy engaged, you and Hammer Ground Forces can take London. London? Why aren't we hitting the Citadel directly? Anderson can brief you on that. Admiral, how are you holding up? We are ready to end this. But as you can see, the station's closed itself since it appeared over London. Damn it. Gotta get the arms open to dock the Crucible. Exactly. But London is surrounded by Hades cannons. Hammer transports can't land while they're active. You lead a squadron of smaller shuttles. Infiltrate with a ground team to take out the cannons using heavy weapons. Hammer can land, and we'll set up a forward operation space. I still don't see how we're getting to the Citadel from London. The Reapers use this beam to transport humans, alive and dead, to the Citadel. From the FOB, Hammer will launch an all-out assault on the Citadel beam. Everyone who makes it that far will take the beam to the Citadel, then locate and activate the Citadel arm controls. Once we see those arms, Shield Fleet will escort the Crucible to the Citadel. But timing will be critical. We don't have enough firepower to keep the Crucible safe for long. This is what we trained for. Nothing's ever easy. No reason it should start now. It's desperate. I don't even want to guess at our odds. But... But this is the only plan we have. If we wait, the Reapers bleed us slowly. Conventionally, we can't defeat the Reapers without the Crucible. Get the Citadel arms open. Commander, whatever the cost, we'll do the rest. Yes, sir. 
Good luck to all of us. I am going to take Javik. No, I'm going to take James. No, no. James and Caden. Let's go. I'm going to try the Gef Pulse um the Gef Pulse rifle 5. That's what I'm going to try. Here's our points now. Here we go. Okay, we're going. Approaching Sol Relay, Commander. We're through the relay in 30 seconds. Get ready to see the most epic battle in video game history. That, in my opinion, this was the this is like the best ending battle in video game history. Alliance fleet reporting. <laughs> fleet reporting. Asari fleet's reporting. Or video games in general. It's it's just so good. Corian fleet reporting. All fleets reporting in, Commander. Ready to engage on your command.
This is it, everyone. Be ready on my signal. Fire! Shepard! Good luck. You too, Joker. Stay safe. I'll be back before you know it. I'll hold you to that. Normandy out. We're closing in on the LZ, Commander. How's it look? Like hell? Take a look for yourself. It's bad. God. It doesn't look like home anymore. Squad responsible for taking out that defense turret. Who's on it now? Nobody in the vicinity. All either deployed or shot down. Drop us off. Sir? We have to take that thing out before Hammer can land. Understood. Change of plans, people. We're gonna take out that Hades cannon. With what? That down shuttle would have been carrying heavy weapons. Perfect. You heard the man. Once we're clear, make your way to the crash shuttle. We'll search the wreckage for heavy weapons. This is gonna be hell! Now! Go! Go! Damn, I can't stay here, sir. Get clear. Come get us once we've taken that turret up. Roger that. Cortez out. All right, everyone. Let's move. This is Captain Johnson.
the fuck? Ah, come on! Come on, yeah! There's the shuttle. Keep an eye out for the heavy weapons. Got it good there. <laughs> personnel in the vicinity. Get us out of here, Corporal. You okay? I'm alive. That you are, Commander. Anderson. I knew you would know me. It's good to see you. And you a sight for sore eyes. How we looking? Now that the heavy air defenses are dealt with, Hammer can land. And not a moment too soon. What's left of the Resistance is holding a forward operating base. But the Reapers are countering already. Once we regroup, it's gonna be up to Hammer to take up the fight. Everyone's prepared for this. They didn't start out together, but they're ready to stand side by side and win this war. Good. That's what it's gonna take. We'll get it done, Anderson. I was born in London. Really? The entire galaxy united. Too bad it took the Reapers to bring us together. Shepard united them. That's exactly what I meant. I know you didn't like leaving, Shepard. But nobody could have accomplished what you've done. It's good to be back home. There's the FOB. Looks good. Give Hammer the all clear.
we've set up a command center in the building over there. Looks like we've still got groups coming in. Yes, sir, but not as many as we'd hoped. Hmm. Come see me when you're ready, Shepard. Will do. He's right. I expected to see more of Hammer here by now. A lot of them won't be making it. Sorry about Cortez. He was a good pilot. You two go on ahead. I'll catch up. The fighting here's been some of the worst on the planet. It looks bad, but there's still hope. And you're here. It'll do the troops good to see you. Bolster their resolve. You think so? I'm just a soldier like them. You might see yourself like that, but they don't. Like it or not, Commander, you're a hero to these men and women. Don't discount the effect that can have on them. I better go meet up with my battalion. I'll see you at the command center. Hey, Caden. Hey, Caden. You ready? Absolutely. For anything. Bring it on. And biotics division? Your students? <laughs> More than ready. Eager. That's youth for you. Guess we're old soldiers. Hey, Shepard? Yeah. I guess we are. We know the score. We know this is goodbye. Don't think like that. We're gonna win this thing. Don't get me wrong. I'm gonna fight like hell to see you on the other side. But listen, I... There's... Things I want to say. And looking back, I have a few regrets, but not many. That's pretty damn amazing, right? Messed up kid that I was. Never would have dreamed of the life I've had. And I owe a lot of that to you, you know? It's been quite a ride. It sure has. But how are you doing? Scared? Hell yeah, of course. Damn straight I'm scared. But that fear's gonna keep me alive long enough to strike these bastards right through the heart. Yeah. Exactly. So... Take care, Major. You too, Commander. Well, I should find the rest of my squad. Yeah. You know, I've never been to London. <laughs> yes, Commander. Is there someone you'd like to reach? Uh, let's talk to Grunt. Grunt. Certainly. I'll connect you now. About time you got here, Shepard. Didn't want to win this thing all by myself. Good to see you back in action, Grunt. Wouldn't miss it. Shepard. Yeah? Thanks for getting me out of that tank. Sure, Grunt. It's been an honor. Same here, Shepard. Okay, Grunt out. Is there someone else I can connect you to? Miranda. Miranda Lawson. Certainly. I'll connect you now. Commander, hope you don't mind me crashing this little party of yours. Not at all. Feeling better? Much. I got a few sideways looks from Alliance Brass when I offered to help. They can't be choosy at this point. I'm glad you made it. Shepard, I, I wanted to say goodbye. Goodbye? If we both come back from this at all, Everything will be different. Sure, everything will change. But on our terms. We've been running until now, Miranda. It has to stop. I understand. This isn't goodbye. You have to believe we're not done yet. Listening to you, 
I can believe it. Good. And Miranda? Yes? Be careful. I promise. And you too, Shepard. Is there someone else I can connect you to? Jacob Taylor. Certainly. I'll connect you now. Shepard, that you? Jacob, holding up? <laughs> Kicking ass more like. My kill count's through the roof. We'll meet and compare notches when this is over. You got it. There's this, uh, great little bar in Rio we have to check out. I'm holding you to that. Give him hell, Jacob. Yes, sir. Shepard out. Is there someone else I can connect you to? I'm done. Yes, sir. Coordinate with the Alliance. Make sure we iron out these logistical problems. Shepard. So I guess this is... Just like old times? <laughs> huh. Uh. Hmm. Might be the last chance we get to say that. Think we're gonna lose? No. I think we're about to kick the Reapers back into whatever black hole they crawled out of. Then, we're going to retire somewhere warm and tropical and live off the royalties from the vids. We've earned it. I'll meet you there. I think my days of saving the galaxy are over when this is done. Be sure to leave room for all the autographs. <laughs> Just need to beat the Reapers to get there. James told me there's an old saying here on Earth. May you be in heaven half an hour before the devil knows you're dead. Not sure if Torian heaven is the same as yours, but if this thing goes sideways and we both end up there, meet me at the bar. I'm buying. No one's dying. We're a team, Garrus. There's no Shepard without Vicarian, so you better remember to duck. Sorry, Torians don't know how. But I'll improvise. And Shepard, forgive the insubordination, but this old friend has an order for you. Go out there and give them hell. You were born to do this. Goodbye, Garrus. And if I'm up there in that bar and you're not, I'll be looking down. I'll always have your back. <laughs> this, I know this ending is going to make me cry. I, I just know it. Here we go. We've got hostiles on the perimeter. Get on that gun. Casualties. 
We lost people. Some of the wounded here won't make it. The Reapers are closing in. How are you holding up, Liara? This is it, isn't it? Yeah. This is it. I don't know what to say. I just know I'll have a clever line five minutes from now. Any last words of encouragement? Don't hold back. Give him hell. Like they've never imagined. Let's do what needs to be done, Shepard. What's his condition? to the galaxy 2,000 years ago. When all seemed lost, and the end was near. One word... There's Rex. I can't talk to him, though. One word beat the monsters. What about this, though? We could circle around and flood it with reinforcements. Not likely. Must spend three days in that sector trapped inside. Almost time for the final push. Are you okay? I thought I'd be asking you that question. Shepard, I backed you when I was just a kid on her pilgrimage. I backed you when the Normandy was a Cerberus ship. Wherever you go, I'm with you. And you haven't answered my question. Are you okay? Seeing her flight now. Absolutely. You know, I really am. I spent months talking to the Council, to Admirals, to politicians. All to get to this moment. No politics, no diplomacy. Just us and them. One last time. Do you remember what we said on Rannoch? Just before you took down that Reaper? I remember. And I meant it. You said, I love you. And you said, Kila Salai. I want more time. I know. Whatever happens. I know. Shepard, I have a question. Is it a big or small one? It is important. Its relevance would be diminished at any other time. Ask away. In this battle, the Reapers have no reason not to use their full capabilities to destroy us. Their forces are in entrenched positions. They have superior firepower and outnumber our forces. My question is, what makes you think we can reach the Conduit at all? They underestimate us. The Reapers have the Citadel. They think they've won, and that's the best time to hit them. If they have spies or other intelligence, we could lose the element of surprise. In such a case, we will likely lose. Are you afraid? Our probability for success is greater than any other plan presented to date. That's not what I asked. Are you afraid? I do not understand the purpose of the question. There's no room for doubt anymore, Edie. You understand what we have to do, or you don't. I am clear on what we must accomplish, Shepard. The Reapers have destroyed thousands of civilizations. But they have never destroyed ours, nor will they. That's what I like to hear. Couldn't have put it better myself. Time to move out. Shepard, there is something I want you to know. The elusive man ordered my creation years ago. Jeff was the one who allowed me to think for myself. But only now do I feel alive. That is your influence. Thanks, Edie. Commander? Admiral? Just going over the sit rep. How's it look? 
Less than 40% of Hammer has reported in. Tell me there's more coming. There's some stragglers still en route. But the bulk of Hammer that's still intact has arrived. We're as ready as we're likely to get. Start the attack. Every minute wasted here, the Reapers gather strength. Exactly my thoughts. Battalion leaders, report to HQ. We fought hard to get here. But now the toughest part of our mission begins. We've got to drive right through the heart of Reaper-controlled territory, break past their defenses, and get to that beam. What kind of defenses? The entire area is crawling with Reaper forces. But our biggest concern is the destroyer, protecting the beam itself. Can we bring in air support to deal with it? Negative. Some kind of interference. We'll have to take it out from the ground. Now they've cut a swath of no man's land through the city. We'll have to cross that first. There'll be some limited shelter on the other side, but expect heavy ground resistance. We need to get our tanks to here, if we get close enough. We've got a shot at taking that thing out. How much of a shot? They know we're coming. This will be a one-way trip for many of us. But there can be no retreat, no stepping back. We move forward at all costs, understood? Yeah! Who yeah? Yes, sir. Johnson, Coates, you two will coordinate the artillery units. Shepard, I'm sending you right up the gut where the resistance is heaviest. Support the tanks the best you can, but stay alive. I need you for the final push to the beam. I'll give you a minute with your squad. Pick your team well. Comrades. This war has brought us pain and suffering and loss. But it's also brought us together as soldiers, allies, friends. This bond that ties us together is something the Reapers will never understand. It's more powerful than any weapon, stronger than any ship. It can't be taken or destroyed. Remember what you fight for. The next few hours will decide the fate of everyone in the galaxy. Every mother, every son, every unborn child. They're trusting you, depending on you to win them their future. A future free from the threat of the Reapers. Be fearless. But take heart. Look around you. You're not in this fight alone. We face our enemy together. And together, we will defeat them. Okay, that was our final speech. Now I gotta figure who I'm taking here. I'm gonna take Javik. I don't want to kill ED off. I really don't. I'm gonna get the bad ending. Okay, understand. That's basically what's gonna happen here. I already know. But I want these four to live. Or, no, wait. I want these one, one, two, three, four. I want these five to live. I, I just do. Okay. Taking these two. Here we go.
we go.
won't do anything but piss it off. Roger that. But we may have no choice, understood. Destroyer just took out half our company, firing remaining missiles. Any effect? Negative. Can't get along. Something's messing with our guidance. We're almost there, right? Okay, in this part you gotta take on waves and waves of enemies. There's the artillery! But the company's been wiped out! Commander, do you read me? Major, what's the situation? The beam's interfering with missile guidance. We can hit the destroyer, but we'll never make the precision strike we need to take it out. Damn it! Edie, can you read me? Yes, Commander. Any suggestions? I may be able to use the Normandy systems to enhance the missile's targeting capabilities. Excellent. I'll need you to open a link to the Normandy from the missile systems. On it. That's it. I'll let you know when I've adapted the targeting systems. Sounds like good news, Commander. We'll see. Hammer. This is Admiral Anderson. The Reaper ground forces are making a push. Hold your ground. Protect those tanks until we can get a shot. You heard it, people. Get ready. There they are! Soldier, heads up! We've got more incoming. Shit! We better cover our left flank.
Got it. You heard her. Back to the truck, people. Missile guidance enhanced. Firing. Countering interference. Did it hit? What happened? The Reaper is still too close to the beam. We're down to two missiles. And the Reaper is still standing. You will need to allow the Reaper to move out of the beam's influence. And closer to us. Commander, hammer's being overrun at every turn. Reaper ground forces are converging on your location. We're fighting our way to you. Hold on, Commander. Hold on. We cannot hold much longer. Hold on, everyone. We can do this. Let's do it. Here they come! Right now they're sending all fucking brutes at me. Okay, we did it. didn't look good. It gets worse. Of course it does. 
Hackett just reported in. Several Sovereign class Reapers, including Harbinger, have broken off from the battle with Sword. They're headed here. Harbinger. It's an opportunity for Hackett to get the Crucible in place. But we have to get a team on board the Citadel to open those arms now. We still don't even know what we'll find when we get to the Citadel. Then that's our job. Find out what we're up against. All right. Saddle up, everybody. Get me Admiral Hackett. Here on in, it's a straight shot for me. A straight shot with Reapers trying to crush us along the way. We just need to get a handful of troops through. Only a handful, huh? We knew this was going to be a gamble at best. No one hold back. No, I'm proud of you all. Can't think of anyone else I'd rather do this with. Me neither, Shepard. We're in sight of the target. All right, everyone. This is it. Shit. Okay, all you gotta do is just run in this part. Run like hell. Way they lived? Normandy, do you copy? I need an evac right now. Oh my god, I actually got him to live. Come on. I didn't want to see James die anyway. Gotta get out of here. This is where I belong. Don't argue with me. But I can still fight. 
I won't let you die here. I need to know somebody's getting out of this alive. Commander! Good luck. <laughs> that was awesome! Oh my god! Go! We're at the ending right now, yeah. I got shot pretty bad there. <laughs> Shit. Anderson, you up here too? I followed you up, but we didn't come out in the same place. No, at least I don't think we did. What's your surrounding look like? <sighs> you okay? I'm okay. Just gotta keep moving. 
dark. There's human remains scattered. Sounds familiar. I'm in a dark hallway. Reminds me of your description of the collector base. Uh, makes sense. You think they're making a reaper in here? Oh, sure. They round them up on Earth, then send the people up here to be processed. might be able to do the special dialogue with the elusive man coming up I don't know we'll see Whoa. Anderson one of the walls here just realigned itself the place is shifting changing there's a chasm here and more hallways like the one I was in I think I'm near an exit Don't get too far ahead of me. Where do you think you're at? Just found that chasm we were talking about. Hold on. I see something. A control panel, maybe. I'm just gonna go on. Anderson! Damn it. If I have a lot of paths open for endings, I might do this part again. And it might be different. Okay, so understand. I might. I don't know. Only if viewers want that. Anderson. the means to survival, control of the Reapers, and of you, if necessary. Mm. They're controlling you. I don't think so, Admiral. You don't get it. Controlling me is a lot different than controlling a Reaper. Have a little faith. When humanity discovered the mass relays, when we learned there was more to the galaxy than we imagined, there were some who thought the relays should be destroyed. They were scared of what we'd find, terrified of what we might let in. But look at what humanity has achieved. Since that discovery, we've advanced more than the past 10,000 years combined. And the Reapers will do the same for us again, a thousandfold. But... <sighs> Only if we can harness their ability to control. Bullshit! We destroy them, or they destroy us. And waste this opportunity? Never. You didn't earn this power. You're playing with things you don't understand. With power you shouldn't be able to use. I don't believe that. If we can control it, why shouldn't it be ours? Because we're not ready. No. This is the way humanity must evolve. There's always another way. I've dedicated my life to understanding the Reapers. 
And I know with certainty the Crucible will allow me to control. <laughs> and then what? Look at the power they wield. Look at what they can do. I see what they did to you. I took what I wanted from them, made it my own. This isn't about me or you. It's about things so much bigger than all of us. He's wrong. Don't listen to him. And who will you listen to, Shepard? An old soldier stuck in his ways, only able to see the world down the barrel of a gun? And what if he's wrong? What if controlling the Reapers is the answer? What if you're wrong? If we destroy the Reapers, this ends today. But if you can't control them... But I can! Are you willing to bet humanity's existence on it? I... No, it will work. You can't, can you? They won't let you do it. No! I'm in control! No one is telling me what to do! Listen to yourself! You're indoctrinated! No! No! The two of you so self-righteous! Do you think power like this comes easy? There are sacrifices! You've sacrificed too much. Shepard, I... I only wanted to protect humanity. The Crucibles can control them. I know it can. I just... It's not too late. Let us go. We'll do the rest. I... Uh, I can't do that, Commander. Of course you can't. They own you now. You... You'd undo everything I've accomplished. I won't let that happen. You're fucking pathetic. You're nothing more than the Reaper's plaything now. Now! You're the one who failed! Looks like you failed, buddy. This part makes me tear yeah. up, man. I wish you could see it like I do, Shepard. It's so... perfect. This is it, everyone. The Commander? We did it. Yes, we did. It's uh, quite a 
inside of you. <laughs> Best seats in the house. God. Feels like years since I just sat down. I think you earned a rest. Anderson? Mm. Mm. Stay with me. We're almost through this. You did good, son. You did good. I'm proud of you. Thank you, sir. Anderson? He's dying. People get so angry that Shepard dies, your character dies at the end of this trilogy. I don't get angry. I think it's like one of the best choices of like, you know, telling a story like this ever. In my opinion. In my opinion, at least. I don't know. I mean, the creators of this game really were building up to something. And they built up to something great. They really did, in my opinion. Citadel was the catalyst. No, the Citadel is part of me. I need to stop the Reapers. Do you know how I can do that? The Reapers are mine. I control them. They are my solution. Solution? To what? Chaos. You bring it on yourselves. The created will always rebel against their creators. But we found a way to stop that from happening. A way to restore order. By wiping out organic life? No. We harvest advanced civilizations, leaving the younger ones alone. Just as we left your people alive the last time we were here. Killed the rest. We help them ascend so they can make way for new life, storing the old life in Reaper form. I think we'd rather keep our own form. No, you can't. Without us to stop it, synthetics would destroy all organics. We've created the cycle so that never happens. That's the solution. You'll never understand. But you're taking away our future. Without a future, we have no hope. Without hope, we might as well be machines. Programmed to do what we're told. You don't need hope. The fact that you were standing here, the first organic ever, proves it. 
but it also proves my solution won't work anymore. So now what? That depends on you. Why are you telling me this? Why help me? You have altered the variables. What do you mean? The Crucible changed me, created new possibilities, but I can't make them happen. If there is to be a new solution, you must act. It is now in your power to destroy us. But be warned, others will be destroyed as well. The Crucible will not discriminate. All synthetics will be targeted. Even you are partly synthetic. Then I won't use the Crucible. I made it this far. We'll destroy you without setting it off. Impossible. You are vastly outnumbered. You have sacrificed many of your resources just to reach this point. If you do not use the Crucible, the Reapers will not be stopped, and the cycle will continue. I don't believe you. Your belief is not required. There has to be another way. There is. You could instead use the energy of the Crucible to seize control of the Reapers. So... The elusive man was right after all. Yes, but he could never have taken control. Because we already controlled him. But I can. You will die. You will control us, but you will lose everything you have. I think I understand what to do. But the Reapers will obey me? Yes. We will be yours to control and direct as you see fit. Hmm. You must release the energy of the Crucible to end the cycle. The paths are open. It is time to choose. And let's end it. Let's get this over with. Do what you must. I'm gonna control him. That way they'll just leave. I don't like the destroy ending. I really don't for many reasons. And I'm, gonna, I'll, I'm not going to go through them, but I hate the destroy ending. I absolutely hate it. I mean, either way, he's gonna die. All the people that died. Oh, people he's thinking of, too. Oh yeah, people he d that died, yes. It's the people that died. Okay, now it's people he's thinking of.
Mass relays are gone. Joker lived! Yay! <laughs> Just as he gave direction to the ones who followed him. The ones who helped him achieve his purpose. Now my purpose. To give the many hope for a future. To ensure that all have a voice in their future. The man I was knew that he could only achieve this by becoming something greater. There is power in control. There is wisdom in harnessing the strengths of your enemy. I will rebuild what the many have lost. I will create a future with limitless possibilities. I will protect and sustain. I will act as guardian for the many. And throughout it all, Never forget. I will remember the ones who sacrificed themselves. So that the many can survive.
his name up there. Because he's dead. They know it. And I will watch over the ones who live on. Those who carry the memory of the man I once was. The man who gave up his life to become the one who could save the many. I want to thank everyone who watched this playthrough of Mass Effect 3 Legendary Edition. I didn't think I'd get that good of an ending. <laughs> Shit. That was a good ending. I liked it. Um, what I got there. Um, yeah, I liked it. I enjoyed playing this game again after years. Yeah, it was fun. I, I'm surprised that um, Javik and James lived at the end. I, I was... I didn't want them to die, but I, I just, you know, I thought if I took them at the end, they would totally just die. Um, but yeah, because I'd never taken them in the final mission, I, and I took them in the final mission. Yeah, it was pretty good. I, I liked the ending I got. Yep. And that's all I have to say. So, n hope you all keep watching my videos. Till next time. <laughs> this was uh, Cole's. This was my this was my video game playthrough of Mass Effect 3 Legendary Edition. Till next time, this is Cole's Playthroughs. Out.
Did that all really happen? Yes, but some of the details have been lost in time. It all happened so very long ago. When can I go to the stars? One day, my sweet. What will be there? Anything you can imagine. Our galaxy has billions of stars. Each of those stars could have many worlds. Every world could be home to a different form of life. And every life is a special story of its own. Tell me another story about the shepherd. It's getting late, but okay. One more story 